B, please report to the cockpit. And please hurry! <gasps> what happened here? I tried to talk to them, but then there was a dust buster, a toupee, a life raft exploded. Now one's bald, one's in a boat, and they're both unconscious. Uh, be joke? No, no one's flying the plane. This is JFK Control Tower, flight 356. What's your status? This is Vanessa Blue. I'm a florist from New York. Where's the pilot? He's unconscious, and so is the co-pilot. Not good. Is there anyone on board who has flight experience? As a matter of fact, there is. Who's that? Barry Benson. From the Honey Trial. Oh, great. Vanessa, this is nothing more than a big metal bee. It's got giant wings, huge engines. I can't fly a plane. Why not? Is it John Travolta a pilot? Yes. How hard could it be? Wait a minute, Barry. We're headed into some lightning. This is Bob Bumble. We have some late-breaking news from JFK Airport, where a very suspenseful scene is developing. Barry Benson, fresh off his stunning legal victory, Barry. is now attempting to land a plane loaded with people, flowers, and an incapacitated flight crew. Flowers? Well, we have an electrical storm in the area, and two individuals at the controls of a jumbo jet with absolutely no flight experience. Just a minute, Mr. Ditchwater. There's a honeybee on that plane. Oh, I'm quite familiar with Mr. Benson's work, and there's no account compadres. Haven't they done enough damage already? But isn't he your only hope right now? Come on, technically a bee shouldn't be able to fly at all. The wings are too small, the bodies are too big. Hey, hold on a second. Haven't we heard this a million times? The surface area of the wings and the body mass doesn't make sense. Get this on the air. You got it. Yeah, We're going live. <laughs> the way we work may be a mystery to you, because making honey takes a lot of bees, doing a lot of small jobs. But let me tell you something about a small job. If you do it really well, it makes a big difference. More than we realize. To us, to everyone. That's why I want to get bees back to doing what we do best, working together. That's the bee way. We're not made of jello. We get behind a fellow. Black and yellow. <laughs> chance if I do what I would do, and you copy me with the wings of the plane. You don't have to yell. I'm not yelling. We happen to be in a lot of trouble here. It's very hard to concentrate with that panicky tone in your voice. It's not a tone. I'm panicking! I don't think I can do this. Vanessa, pull yourself together. Listen to me. You have got to snap out of it. You snap out of it! You snap out of it! You snap out of it! How's the plane flying? I don't know. Hello? Hey, Benson, have you got any flowers for a happy occasion in there? The pollen jocks. They do get behind a fellow. Black and yellow. Hello. All right, you two. What do you say we drop this tin can on the blacktop? On blacktop? Where? I can't see anything. Can you? No, nothing. It's all cloudy. Come on. you got to think B, Barry. Thinking B. 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 Wait a minute. I think I'm feeling something. What? I don't know, but it's strong and it's pulling me. Like a 27 million year old instinct. Bring the nose of the plane down. What in the world is on the time man? Get some lights on that! <laughs> Oh, I mean the job.
Johnny in black and yellow pulsating, bro. We're made of millions of bees! Pull forward, nose down, bring your tail up. Rotate around it. Oh, this is insane, man. This is the only way I know how to fly. My cuckoo cachoo, or is this plane flying in an insect-like pattern? Get your nose in there, don't be afraid of it, smell it. Pull it first! Is he just on it? Be part of it? Thank you, sister! Now drop it in! Drop it in, woman! giant flower? What giant flower? Where? Of course I saw the flower. That was genius, man. Genius. Hey, 